Hey, what's up guys? Seth here and I'm back with another video. And we're going to start this thing off right away with um, checking out my Pikachu and Butter Freeze uh, stuff and all that because I think I forgot to at the end of the last episode. So Butterfree and Pikachu here. Butterfree has this thing that raises its accuracy, which is nice. Um, it is definitely a speedy Butterfree with some decent defense. And we have a speedy Pikachu and it has static process on impact and it is definitely speedy with a nice physical attack and that is just a quick look over the team you can pause at any point if you want to see anyone specific stuff but let's just get on with this video right away because i want to go and get these running shoes thank god we don't have to walk everywhere anymore we can finally sprint and talk itty talk itty talk itty talk quit talking no one cares. Alright, so, um, yeah, I think that's all the talkity talkity stuff done. Um, let's just grind up here in this route. Because what we want to do is we want to get fully through this route and finish it all up and call it all good. Oh, yeah, and I think, um, is either. Between this video and last video, or between last video and this video, I don't remember, but I got all my Pokemans to level 15, and yeah, that's cool, but we're gonna get through this whole route today, and get to Mount Moon, I think it is, is what the objective for today is, so we just got to beat the pants off of a lot of scrub trainers, basically, is what we got to do, and uh, yeah, as you see here, all my level 15 mans, and I definitely think Hawkeye and Sparky are going to be the two Pokemon that are going to put in the most work in this route. By far, if there are two that are going to do it, I think it's going to be these. Because I think most of the trainers in this route are going to be Bug Catchers and Bird Trainers, or whatever the heck they're called. But, um, yeah. Um, that's Trainer 1 down. Are there any trainers over here? There are not. Okay, let's run back up here and take on Trainer number 2. Um... So, guys, I've been really enjoying this kind of stuff. I know it has obviously been, like, a week, maybe two weeks. I don't remember quite yet. But it's been a while since my last upload. And I'm recording this video, like, as... Okay. So, last video, I recorded it and I uploaded it. I have done with all these. It's been, like, two weeks, a week, a week and a half, four or five days, just something like that. I don't remember exactly since I've uploaded a video. And I'm going to record this and then upload it right away. It is like 2 a.m. or something like that. Um, and that's how I'm going to do it. Um, but I've been really enjoying it. And I want to do other series. I really do. So in the next couple of days, maybe a week from now, I don't know. Um, there might be an upload of a different series or something. I do not know for sure. Um, I don't know when the next video of this will go up after this one. It is just whenever I want to do something is when I do it. And that's how I'm doing it because that's when I, because when I'm having fun doing it is when I'm doing it. I don't want to rush anything. I don't want to feel like I have to do anything because that's how I don't want to do it anymore. And I just want to take my time. So yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe possibly a new series is coming back or out on the channel. Um, and probably just continuing this one. So we'll just see what happens. Obviously you guys will know um, when and if any of those videos come out, what's happening there. But uh, we took down that trainer, and let's go with trainer three. Sorry about just sporadic, you know, just kind of talking and whatnot. I'm trying to keep this a little bit entertaining, trying to keep myself awake and whatnot. Like I said, it is like 2.07 in the morning right now, April 21st or something like that. Just breaking the fourth wall there. Um, it's uh, it's early. But, um, uh, yeah, I'm just going to take them down this ratatata. And uh, call it good. Um. So next episode, because by the end of this video, we're going to be at the end of this whole route and ready to go to the Mount Moon. I think we're just going to tackle all of Mount Moon in next episode, and maybe just get ready to do stuff in the the next town and whatnot, and just do all that in the next episode. I really don't know. We'll tell more when that time comes. Sorry about the noise in the background. If you hear it, that is my heater turning on. It always turns on on them in the most inopportune times 
when I am recording, I cannot speak. It is so early in the morning slash late, depending on how you look on, at it, because I've been up nearly 24 hours at this point. But I was really feeling Pokemon, and I was really feeling recording, so that's what I am doing. Um, and then still breaking the fourth wall after I record all this, then I have to edit it, um, then render it, and then upload it. And I could just set it to upload and then go to sleep if I want, but editing and rendering alone will take half an hour probably, um, half an hour to 45 minutes. So I'm looking to not even be able to upload it until 3, so I won't even be able to go to sleep until about 3. Um, and then I have to be back up by like 7, so it's like 4 hours worth of sleep. And that's if I do decide to go to sleep. I might not even go to sleep, and if that's the case, then well... It's going to be a really, really long day tomorrow. Um, but, uh, yeah. Just taking down all of these guys with Hawkeye. Hawkeye is going to be gaining lots of XP here. Boom. Just pecking away. And I think I have the experience share on Sparky. Just because Sparky is going to be the main guy going to the next gym. That is actually why I catch my Pikachu. Is because the second gym... Um, I definitely, definitely, definitely want an electric type going into that, and that just makes Sparky perfect. Um, I was doing some thinking in between, and you know how, like, in the next city, you can catch Abra. I was doing a lot of thinking, and I was like, Alakazam, or just Kadabra, would not be bad mons to have on the team. I mean, they really wouldn't. I can get rid of probably, like, I don't know, um, hmm... Like, maybe, like, Primeape or whatever for one of them. And it wouldn't be that bad. Like, I could actually live with that. But, um, uh, I don't think I'm going to do that. I'm going to go with my, my team that I have built out of just random Pokemon that I think will get me through the game, basically, and calling it good. Right now, though, when we want Butterfree, you know, I can also get rid of Butterfree. Because, honestly, I only have Butterfree for all the spores and confusion. Like, I have it for Confusion, and all the Spores, and, like, Kadabra obviously learned Psychic, so it would be even better than Butterfree for the main reason I have Butterfree. And then, well, I just wouldn't do Spores, but I could honestly live without doing Spores. But, um, yeah. And then I was also thinking that, um, uh, like the Snorlaxes and the Himalayas slash Hitmonchan, like, I could switch the Snorlaxes or any of those for any Pokemon, and it'd still be fine, but I, I don't know how I feel about that. And then, obviously, I'm not going to use Legendaries, like I said earlier, um, which I'm completely fine with. And I'm going to be doing the post-game. Um, I might switch up my team for the post-game, like I might actually use Legendaries in the post-game. I don't know, though. Um, I might switch up my team and put other mods on it for post-game, but like I said, I don't know. We'll have to see when all that time comes but, um, uh, dang, we're really getting through this route. I feel like we're getting fairly close to the end. There's got to be, like, three more trainers, maybe, in this whole thing. There's the, this one, and then I think one more trainer, and that's it for this route. So, dang, this episode's already coming to a close. But, yeah, um, there are obviously a lot of other Pokemon that I could add to the team. And it might actually be better than the team I'm forming. But I think I'm just going to go with this team that I have set, and that's what we'll do. Um, as time goes on, if I want to change something, I might, because, like, that Lapras that we get later, that thing learns Parish Song. Do you know how valuable Parish Song is in, like, the Elite Four and all that? It is amazing. Like, absolutely amazing. Um, which is a major reason why, if I, if I do end up searching up the team, it would be to put on Lapras, just because of the reason that we can learn Parish Song, but, um, yeah, for now, the team's gonna stay the way it is, but it could change in the future, so, if it does, don't be too shocked, it's just because there are way better mons that I could have on it, they could do awesome stuff, because look at Lapras, he can learn, like, Thunder, Ice Beam, Surf, and Parish Song, that is an amazing set of moves, like, that is perfect, and he is bulky, He's super bulky, and I'm pretty sure has a really high special attack, which is amazing. So, you know, Lapras might join the team eventually, and if he does, it would probably be to take out either Butterfree or, um, or Primeape. 
either one of those two. If I do change out anyone on the team, it would be taking out Bao Boa here, the main key, which will be a Prime Ape, or Booter Flea, which is my Butter Free. Those would be the two going. But I don't know if I'm going to do that anytime soon. But it is a possibility. But enough rambling on about that. I think we have cleared every trainer in this whole route. So now what we can do is uh, talk to this guy. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, nothing. We could run up here, heal up, and um, uh, you ready to go to Mount Moon, I think this is. Pretty sure this is Mount Moon. But um, yeah, guys, if you did like the video, please do not forget to drop a like. If you're new to the channel, please do not forget to subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Have a great day, everybody. Yeah.